Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Nintega Gamer, and welcome back to some more Sly 3. In the last episode, guys, we did some more- n oh god, no! Okay, <laughs> we did some naval battles, guys, and in today's episode, guys, we're gonna be doing some more missions, possibly taking on Crusher, and then I don't remember what the other mission was. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, I was hoping we could sail through these, and looks like we can. Also, I was so focused on ship battling the other day. I didn't even get to ask you guys how you guys were doing. So, I'm gonna do that now. How you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good myself. Happy to be bringing you guys some more Sly 3 today. Be Like I said, don't know which mission we're... Oh, what am I saying? It's called Crusher from the Deep. So, I guess we're doing Crusher from the Deep. I was just like, let's sail that way. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Be guys. So, let's keep going. Yeah, hopefully you guys are doing good today. I'm doing pretty good myself. And ooh, that fog looks thicker than the other fog. These deep, misty waters are said to be home to the monster. Keep a sharp eye out. Sorry, Bentley, but I can't see a thing in this fog. If your sea monster's here, there's no way we'll find him. Well, it's imperative we track it down and discover why the pirates fear it so vehemently. Panda King. Do you have any fireworks that might light the place up a little? Make it easier to spot the creature? My fireworks are not flares. They burst with ferocious beauty and then disappear like the lightning. We should really get out of here. With visibility this bad, we might sail into a rock. The boat might take some real damage. Okay, now that's some real damage. The sea monster is upon us. Go below deck and placate the others. I will confront this creature with my firework artistry. Give a shout if you need any backup. I'll stand ready. Let's go, guys. Us versus a sea monster. Guess I should be constantly charging. So what I don't want to do is overcharge. Overcharge. I need to. I need to finish Sunset Overdrive. <laughs> There's so many games on my backlist that I need to finish besides my LPs. Like seriously, guys, I've just become so busy, like that I haven't been able to do anything. It's ridiculous. Other than Sly 3, of course, when I'm forcing myself to record it. Oh, jeez. Ow, I just got flabbernobbered. So, you now choose to face me. Behold the Panda King, your master. And there he is. Let's go. I'm assuming in this instance that it's okay for the ship to take damage. Yeah, I'm guessing so, because I think it's just me I have to be worried about for once, which is nice. <laughs> How many fireworks can you take to the mouth, dude, or whatever that um, hole is? <laughs> Hide oh, beneath geez. the waters! Hide from your better! The ship's getting pulled under. If we get tipped over too far in either direction, we're as good as sunk. Oh jeez. Ah, stress! Off my ship, you slimy son of a gun! Oh boy. It's close. Any further, and we're sunk. Get off! Oh, I forgot I can melee as a panda king. 
Alright, let's say we're good. Phew. Oh jeez. And he's up yes, further now. Rise, and let me punish you. They What the balls! Okay. Um, yeah, I'm sure that tentacle's not supposed to be inside the boat. Okay. You can't run when you're charging fireworks. Oh, you can jump at least. That gives you a little bit more momentum. Alright, let's keep going. Hooey! Oh cool, I let go quick enough. Just to let go of it. How's it we're good? Rah! Timid creature. With my beautiful fireworks I will. I they are all gone. Cooper! Your assistance is requested! I'm here. What's the score? Protect the vessel while I go below and hurriedly craft more fireworks. Sure thing. <laughs> he burned through Billy, all his you fireworks. Check out that fight? Crusher must be on its last legs at this point. I mean, what could he have left? I'd say about another hundred feet and a dozen tentacles. Just a rough guess. Oh boy. Oh. How would you like cannonballs to the- Oh, your our ship is on fire. How would you like cannonballs to the face? Oh. Oh yeah, guys, I upgraded the cane smack, so now- Or not the cane smack, the, uh, the, the twirly do. So we spin forever now, it's great! I also upgraded the, uh, the push too, so push is even more powerful. Okay, here we go. Okay. You got Boop. It. Keep it up. Okay, wait for a good opportunity. Aha! Oh, come on, I was gonna say that's dumb. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna wait here. There we go. Got him! Alright, he's coming in. Boop! Get booped, dude. Jeez, it's so easy to get stuck on his tentacles. That, that sounds so weird. Alright, just a few more. Oh, jeez. Be coming in for a spook a dook. Boop. A grand battle that was worthy of the names King and Cooper. You really softened him up for me. That was a solid action reaction, bros. You two stands tall. Say, Guru, could you get inside this creature's mind? Oh, da da da. Hope you do. That's a brilliant idea, but are you sure you can pull it off? Hey, Papa, come Hi, Papa, Honda. Then let's do it. Just take any precautions you can. What's he trying to do? Getting us a new ally out here in the sea. Hi, Papa, Jaha! Don't leave us! Who knew uh, giant krakens fed on koalas, eh? <laughs> I don't think that's the last we'll see of the guru. The guru? So, let's not jump to conclusions. B, let's keep sailing this way. I think if you sail off the map, you sail to the other side. So let's see. 
Jeez, I wonder how much treasure is just out here. Yeah, because we're just, we're basically just stuck out here until we complete, um, are we, are we actually making any distance? I don't think anything's happening. Yeah, I don't think, I think, yeah, I don't think we can do what I thought we could do. Alright guys, finally made it here, good lord. Let's do some deep sea danger. We're close to the shipwreck. Drop anchor near the beach. Are you all set with your gear? Got the gear, got the macho swimsuit, got more juice than you'll ever know. Wow. I'm a hit single with a bullet. Cool, daddy-o. How about you take your pimp self down beneath the H2O and get nasty with the scuba? Yo, with bling. Hey, man, you can try, but you'll never capture my essential style. It's like smoke, ungrabbable, and all over the place. But no matter nothing, come at me with some turtle talk. You've got your own flavor. Fine. Your objective is beyond the reef. We're looking for some more of these cannon blast amplification callers. We'll move the boat above the wreck and lower a basket for you to drop them into. Ooh, cool, bro. I'll cup the colors and spice up your basket big time. Solid. Hey, uh, you want some depth optimizers for your scuba mask? It might help you spot sharks. As much as I would like to see sharks, no 3D. Belly's like, what? But, but, but the sharks! <laughs> oh, jeez. You guys don't want to know where I've been the past few minutes. Well, well hey, those were a second there. for you guys. Use the action buttons to move forward, left, right, and back. Hit the R1 button to fire your spear gun. This is weird. Yeah, guys, we're playing as Dimitri. Dimitri is first person. First person underwater swimming. And the control scheme is really weird. It may seem like I'm flying around. We've repositioned the ship and are lowering the basket for you to drop the blast collars into. And uh, a word to the wise. If one of those sharks attack, I'd use a face button to swim sideways. Could mean the difference between life and death. Yeah, um, you use, the, you use circle, X, triangle, and square to move Dimitri. So, triangle is forward. Oh, how do I drop it in there? Excellent. These there we go. Blast so, weirdly enough, triangle's forward, the X is back, this upgrade, our and then you can strafe with uh, square and circle. And, and then R1 is shoot. But yeah, we got freaking sharks down here. All right, I think I just need to get close to it or above That's it. Two. There we go. Only four more to go. You're a lifesaver, Dimitri. We had a few blast callers on board, but without a full set, it's hard to calibrate the guns oh, for synchronized discharge. Gosh, I remember You're playing this there. part as a just kid. Three more. I'm being freaking terrified of these sharks. I mean, who isn't terrified of sharks? I mean, if you're not terrified of sharks, are you human? No, I'm kidding. But, like, I'll admit, I was a bit traumatized by, um, I don't think his name is Sushi. Or maybe it is Sushi. Sushi the Shark. Only two to go. But, um, in Super Mario 64. But, Unagi, that's his name. Unagi the Eel gave me nightmares. <laughs> Unagi terrified me, dude. Like, he made it where I was too scared to go swim in deep water. He made me afraid of the deep end of my swimming pool. <laughs> but yeah. I just, I don't like, oh jeez, oh jeez, ow, that did a lot of damage. I just don't like big fish with teeth. Okay. So it's probably deep down, dark down here. Oh god, that's a shark by me, isn't it? Yup! Oh jeez. Oh gosh. Alright, there it is, there it is. Let's just get it and get out of here. Ah! No, please don't hit me! I'm just getting wumble comboed by the shark, dude. Come on! Oh, there's another one down here? What the hell? Stay away from the open water. The current will carry you down to your doom. Perfect. We're hauling. 
gobbling up the goods. Now for stage two. In order to make full use of the blast callers, we'll need to fortify our gunpowder with some ground hammerhead shark bones. They're attracted to yellow dartfish. Swim down to the caves under the reef and capture a couple. Oh, now I remember. I was going to say, They're down I'm here like... somewhere. Get ready for some fast swimming. Because I was going to say, wait a minute, aren't there, oh geez, I was going to say, aren't there like hammerheads here? Nice, catch one but, more uh, and hammerhead sharks are sure to show up. It wouldn't have been nice to know about the, um, the boost a little earlier. Don't you think, Bentley? Are you, I should probably save my shot until, for when the shark is literally charging me. Okay. Oh, of course they're going the same way. I don't care. Impressive swimming, Dimitri. As expected, the hammerhead sharks have arrived. Head to the top of the reef and get ready for some deep sea hunting. Remember to swim sideways when a shark is charging. It's the time-honored method to avoid getting eaten. Stick and move. Oh god, I'm dead. I'm shark bait. Shark bait! Ooh ha ha! Okay. Oh man, I remember. God, like, they're so terrifying, dude! Like, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are as terrified of sharks as I am. Okay, I missed that shot royally. The other thing that kills me is the wait time on the recharge for Dimitri's gun. Okay. We need all the hammerhead sharks you can get. Take your time and play it safe. But if you can, take out all of the hammerhead sharks in the area. Ow, ow, ow. As creepy as it may be, the best way Ooh, excuse me, to hit these guys is definitely to get their attention and then have them charge you. Otherwise, you're going to be playing the sniping game. God dang it. Thank you. All right, where's another one? God, this is so scary in first person. Hey, it's anyone I want. Like, did Insomniac... Insomniac... Did, um, what are they called? Have to make them that freaking terrifying? Good lord. Yes, laugh at me if you think that's scary. If you don't think that's scary. But I do. Okay. Come on. You're an undersea force, Dimitri. Looks like there's only one oh, airhead <laughs> shark left. Um, no thanks, Galaxy Gear thingamaboop watch. I don't need you to do a thing for me. <laughs> My Gallic, my Samsung gear thought I was saying a phrase. I should probably not be looking at my watch while I'm swimming towards a shark. Oh, jeez. Okay. Heh. <sighs> okay. But, um, I'm, I'm, I'm being so silly. I didn't even admit to mention it. We're freaking playing as Dimitri, and that's awesome. Magnificent, bro. Your method and madness have cold set us up with a fat pirate gat. You're a solid gold all-star on the Team Cooper label. We're ready to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a death's head. We'll see how smart that left wee is with a cannonball in his face. Operation Reverse Double Cross. Our goal, as we all know, is to save Penelope. Given her crafty nature, Lefui has undoubtedly locked her up in one of his most secure locations. They are, one, the Skull Keep, and two, the Brig of the Death's Head. Our team is too small to assault both simultaneously, so we'll have to fall back on a little sleight of hand. First, we sail in and exchange broadsides with the Death's Head. Armed with the element of surprise and our cannon upgrades, it should be a fair fight. But remember, Penelope might be on board, so we cannot sink this ship. Once the masts fall, Sly should jump onto the enemy vessel and then promptly surrender. 
A necessary step for two reasons. First, that boat is packed with pirates, way too many to fight hand to hand. And second, it's the best way to get an audience with Lafuit. Given his smug nature, he's sure to brag where she's hidden if we can get him angry enough. Got that, Sly? Irritate the daylights out of this guy. It's our best and only chance to rescue Penelope. Once he talks, we roll out plan A or B, depending on the situation. This Lefui is a smart man. Our only hope is to outsmart him at his own game. Alright guys, and with that, we just have one more job left to pull off. Operation Reverse Double Cross. So I think that with that, guys, it's the perfect time to end off today's episode. But also, really neatly, we now have a cannon upgrade. And I believe the cannons do extra damage now, instead of it just being a purely aesthetic-looking thing. But I think that's awesome. But, uh, but yeah, also, poor Dimitri. His time to get played was so short-lived. But luckily, we'll be playing as the funky, cool lizard one more time, or a few more times later on. But anyway, without any more blabbing, guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. Because we're almost going on 30 minutes without editing out my long-ass time traveling across the sea. But if you guys enjoyed this episode of Sly 3, be sure to thunderbolt that like button, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!